Today, we will be testing the Master Super Trend Indicator. Who am I? I am DP Roberts, and for years, I've been testing hundreds of trading indicators and strategies here on this channel, and I am constantly testing more. I've compiled all that information into spreadsheets and used it to create a profitable trading strategy with custom indicators. We have an amazing community on Discord where we help you become a profitable trader and you will get access to our custom indicators as well as the spreadsheets of hundreds of tested indicators and strategies when you become a Patreon member. So even if this strategy isn't great, we have you covered. Links below in the description. All right, as I said, today we will be testing the Master Super Trend Indicator. Before we do, though, I wanted to put the testing scoreboard up for everyone to see. So to date, we have tested a total of 81 different strategies. We have tested a total of 883 indicators, and we've tested a total of 83 indicators in the advanced testing stage. If you are interested in a full list of these indicators and strategies and their win rates that we have tested, we've compiled all that information into spreadsheets, which you will get when you become a patron of the channel. Now, keep in mind that we test most of these strategies and indicators on the Forex and crypto market, but they can be applied to just about any market and time frame universally. So today we will be testing the master super trend indicator. You can see it here on screen. When the super trend indicator line here turns green, that's going to be a signal to go short. When it turns red, that's going to be a signal to go long. Now, this indicator can be modified. It has quite a few different settings, which is why it's called the Master Super Trend Indicator. You can go in and change multiple um, inputs on how uh, the line is calculated. Now, it is a little backwards in the coloration here. Normally, uh, we would be getting a green line to go long and a red line to go short, but for some reason, it's a little bit backwards in this case. And so, uh, we are going to go ahead and stick to the colors that it is uh, that it has on default now, and we'll go ahead and get on with the testing and see what we can get out of it. All right, so the first signal that we pick up is a short signal. You can see that that line turns green right there. Price is down below the line, and we get a nice push to the downside there. Let's go ahead and continue on. All right, we then pick up a long signal. It's a line turns red right here, and price is above that line. Unfortunately, we make an immediate push to the downside there. That one's going to come down and stop us out. All right, so what I'm going to do now is go ahead and fast forward through the rest of the testing. That way things don't get too long, and we'll pick this up when we are at the end of the year. All right, so that puts us at the end of the year right there. Before we take a look at what this was able to achieve, if you are looking for a profitable trading strategy, I highly recommend you check out the strategy that we have developed here on the channel. I put a thumbnail of it up right now on screen. I will also link to it at the end of this video with that same thumbnail. This is a proven profitable trading strategy that we have tested, uh, back tested, forward tested, and we are constantly tweaking and optimizing it and making it better. We are also looking to automate the strategy. Hopefully that's something we will do here in the near future. We will have ready and finished. Uh, once we have that ready, any of our current patrons at the time will get a discount discounted version of that automated strategy. So there is a lot of benefits to becoming a patron of the channel. I highly recommend that you join us. All right. And before we take a look at this, please give the video a thumbs up. Even if it doesn't uh, meet the 60% criteria, please don't give the video a thumbs down. It hurts the YouTube algorithm and we want to keep YouTube happy. All right. Let's take a look at our indicator here. Scroll this back here some. All right, let's go ahead and count it out and see what we have. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. So we have eight trades all together, and we have one, two, 
and three winning trades. And so unfortunately, that is not going to meet the 60% criteria that we are looking for. Now, it is possible that we may revisit this one and try some of the other inputs on it to see uh, if it does any better. Not really sure. We'll see as time goes on. But for now, it is going to go on the no list and we will move on to the next video from here.